Hey guys, it's your boy Peter John. Welcome to the episode 679 of Logo History. Today I'm going to talk about Bajka, Intel Pentium 4HT, Kopec, Jadinka, Run Sackboy Run, and Club de Deports Copiapo. These are the people who requested today's logos. I hope you like it. First, I'm gonna talk about Run Sackboy Run. It is a free-to-play endless running game developed by Firesprite and published by PlayStation Mobile that was released on iOS on October 30, 2014, Android on December 17, 2014, and PlayStation Vita on March 31, 2015. The game has no real plot except for Sackboy running through Craftworld from the Negativitron. 2014 to 2014, there are the words Run Sackboy and Run in blue text. Here is a part of a trailer. Okay, now I'm gonna talk about Intel Pentium 4 HT. It is the hyper-threading version of the Intel Pentium 4, a series of single-core CPUs for desktops, laptops and entry-level servers manufactured by Intel. The HT processors were shipped from November 2002 until January 2006. 2002 to 2003, there is a white, blue and orange rounded rectangle, and on the white part there is a blue ring, and inside it, there are the words Intel and inside in blue text, and on the right of the ring, there are two orange squares, and on them, there are the white letters H and T, and on the blue part, there is the word Pentium in white text, and on the orange part, there is a white number 4. Here is the 2D version and an intro. 2003 to 2006, the logo is darker. Here is the print version, the 2D version, the extreme version and an intro. 2006 to 2008, there is a white and blue shape, and on the white part there is a blue ring, and inside it, there is the word Intel in blue text, and on the blue part, there are the words Pentium 4 HT and inside in white text. Here is the extreme version. Alright, now I'm gonna talk about Club de Deports Copiapo. It is a Chilean football club based in Copiapo, Atacama region. Founded in 1999 after regional Atacama's folding, it currently plays in the Primera Division, the first level of the Chilean football system, and holds its home games at Estadio Luis Valenzuela Hermosilla, which has a capacity of 8,000 spectators. 1999 to 2010, there is a green shiat, and on it there are the words Deports and Copiapo in white text, and under them there is a white shape, and inside it, there is a green drawing of a man wearing a helmet and looking at a football, and under the drawing, there is the word Chile in green text. 2010 to 2014, there are the words Deports and Copiapo in green text, and between them there is a green and white football, and under it there is a green shield, and on it, there are the white letters C, D and C, except the letter D is in green text and on a white shape, and under the shape there are three white shapes, and on the one in the middle, there is a green drawing of a lion. Here is an intro. 2014 to the present, there is a red shield, and on it there are the white letters C, D and C, except the letter D is in red text and on a white shape, and under it, there are three white shapes, and on the one in the middle, there is a red lion's face. Here is an intro. Okay, now I'm gonna talk about Jadinka. It is a radio channel broadcast by the Polish public broadcaster, Polski Radio. It is dedicated to information and easy listening music. Program I began test transmissions on February 1, 1925, and began regular transmissions on April 18, 1926, one year after Polski Radio was founded. 1926 to 1990 something, here we have the logo of the first Jadinka's name, Polski Radio Program 1. There is a black ring and inside it there are seven black rings, and under the bigger ring, there are two black lines, and connected to them there is a black shield, and inside it, there are the black letters P and R, and under them there is a black shield, and inside it, there is a black and white drawing of a power line. 1990 something to 1994, there are the blue letters P and R, and on the right of them there is a blue shape, and on it, there is a yellow number 1. Here is a bumper. Polskie Radio, Jedynka. 1994 to 2005, there are four yellow rings, and on them there is a white shape, and on it, there are the words Polski Radio and one in black text. Here is a commercial. Mm. 
Nieważne w jaki sposób się budzisz. Najważniejsze, że zaczniesz dzień od sygnałów dnia. Sygnały dnia od 5 do 9 rano w radiowej jedynce. Wiesz, że się dowiesz. 2005 to the present, they changed its name to Jadinka. There is a white square on an orange outline, and inside it there are three orange rings, and on the right of the square, there is an orange rectangle, and inside it, there are the words Judinka Polski and Radio in white text. Here is a variant and a commercial. A ty co? Boli cię coś? Paweł, włącz się. Dziś jest 144 dzień roku. Słońce wstaje o 4.29. Imieniny obchodzą dziś... Joanna. Żeby wiedzieć, trzeba słuchać. Od kiedy pamiętam, słucham sygnałów dnia. Jedynka. To jest radio. All right, now I'm gonna talk about Kopek. It is a Chilean energy and forestry company with a chain of gas stations throughout Chile. Kopek was founded in 1934. The first president of COPEC, Pedro Aguirre Cerda, later became president of Chile. Today Roberto Angelini Rossi is the president of COPEC. 1934 to 1957, there is a blue triangle, and on it there is a white rectangle on a blue outline, and inside it, there is the word COPEC in red text. Here is a variant. 1957 to 1983, there is the word COPEC in orange text. Here is a commercial. Las personas, el mundo suyo, su actividad, su misión, todo es más seguro cuando se inicia en Copec. 1983 to 1987, the text is now in red text. Here is a commercial. gasolinas MC de serie 2 de Copec. Más energía a su servicio. 1987 to 1998. The font has changed, and now under the word Copec, there are the words Primera N and Servicio in black text. Here is a commercial. La compra al paso más rápida de la ciudad. Minicentros Copec. Otro servicio de la primera en servicio. 1998 to 2015. The font has changed and the logo is darker. Here is a commercial. Oye, ¿dónde lo juntamos? En Milipeuco. Trapa, trapa. Nos vemos en Pichanco. Pichi. Gualañé. Buen pase, buen chicura. ¿Buen qué, güey? En Bincún, en Bincún. ¡Nos vemos a pilla! ¡Oye, güey! ¿Y quiero apoyar? ¿Se lo contamos en el próximo Acobec mejor? ¿Cuál es la de Uqueco? ¿O Pilauco? Este verano, no importa dónde vayas, tu primer destino siempre es una Copec. Copec, primera en servicio. 2015 to 2023, the words Primera N and Servicio have been removed, and the font has changed. Here is a commercial. Oh, se pasó. Mira qué linda. Lo único que nos falta es encontrarnos con Condorito. 
Vuelve a Copec, la colección Condorito de Oro, en revistas y tomos de lujo, desde 990 pesos. No te quedes plop y ven a Copec, primera en servicio. 2023 to the present, the font has changed, and the letter E is now made of three red rectangles. Here is a variant and a commercial. Tu app nuevo ahora se llama App Copec. Nos renovamos para que disfrutes una mejor experiencia. Copec. Okay, now I'm gonna talk about Vodka. It is a Slovak television channel owned and operated by RTVS. 1970 to 1980, here we have the logo of the first Vodka's name, ST2. There are the white, red and blue letters C, S and T. 1980 to 1990, there is the word Eskoslovenska in white text, and under them there are three red shapes, and in the middle of them there is a white number 2, and under the shapes, there is the word Televise in white text. 1990 to 1993, here we have the logo of the second Vodka's name, S1. There is the word S1 in blue text on a black outline made out of blue squares. Here is a variant. 1993 to 1996, here we have the logo of the third Vodka's name, SVT2. There are three shapes a red square and yellow rectangle and a blue triangle, and on them there is the word STV in black text, and on the right of the shapes, there is a black number too. 1996 to 1999, there are four squares of white on a black outline, a blue, a red, and a gray, and on them there is the word STV2 in white text, except the letter S is in black text. 1999 to 2001, there is a orange and yellow square, and on it there is a white curved line, and above it, there is a white number 2, and under the square, there is the word STV in black text. Here is a bumper. From 2001 to 2004, there is a black rounded rectangle, and on it there is a blue rounded square, and on it, there is a black curved line, and on the right of the square, there is the word STV2 in white text. Here is the icon and a bumper. In 2004 to 2012, they finally changed its name to Vodka. There is a number 2 made out of a white shape and a blue triangle. Here is a variant and a bumper. <laughs> 2012 to the present, there is a black square, and on it there are two white dots, and on the right of them there is a white number 2. Here is the HD version, the boxless version, the version with rounded corners and a bumper. Okay guys, this is it for today. I really hope you liked it. Stay tuned for the episode 680 that is going to be about Boots, Allstate, Chorian, Shizo, State Farm, Kachantan, Mariah Carey, Odeon Cinemas and Villarica Team U of. And also don't forget to join my Discord server and to subscribe to my channel so you can watch all my videos. I am Peter John, this is Logo History and until the next video, bye.